Aboriginal art is the world's longest art-making tradition, having gone on for the past 40,000 years. This is an exciting time. The contemporary art world has moved beyond the Western canon and embraced artists and artworks from all corners of the globe. There is a natural symbiosis between Western contemporary art and Aboriginal art. One only has to look at the paintings of Boxer Milner, Butcher Sherrill, and Billy Thomas, their bold abstraction, geometric patterning, and opticality, to see why collectors drawn to Western art from the post-war era would find Aboriginal art to be similarly resonant. This large-scale masterwork by Wallampiri Chapaljari was included in the artist's exhibition at Documenta 13. The work draws the viewer into an ethereal desert landscape that ebbs and flows with the rhythm of winds sculpting sand hills. There is no focal point. Instead, the viewer's peripheral vision takes the eye on an elusive journey across the canvas. Jempo Japananka's Wati Kujara at the water site of Mamara is inspired by the artist's return to his traditional land, Wilkinkara, Lake Makai. It relates to the creation of Wilkinkara by two brothers who lit a fire that scorched the landscape, clearing the way for this saltwater lake. The alternating bands of white, yellow, and red stretch over a vast canvas, transforming it into a landscape alight with the power of fire and radiating with ancestral energy. Patty Bedford used earth pigments on linen to create Cockatoo at Police Hall, one of his largest and most significant paintings. Featured in the artist's retrospective at Sydney's Museum of Contemporary Art and exhibited widely in museums in Australia and the United States, it comes from the latter and most sought after period of the artist's career. Body Marks from 2000 is by Prince of Wales Midpol, a ceremonial leader and renowned dancer who did not begin painting until later in life, translating Larakia ceremonial body painting designs into acrylic paint on canvas. His works grew over time, culminating in large-scale paintings that asserted his cultural authority. This example is one of the most celebrated and is distinguished by a luminous blue and black background, which represents the skin color of Larakia performers. The paintings in this collection are a reminder that we should all look beyond what is familiar. Mm -hmm.